Hey guys, Ross here again and today we'll show you how to remove all kind of locks from every Samsung phone with Android 10 and latest security patch from June 2020, May 2020 or April 2020. In this video we'll bypass factory reset protection and remove Google and Samsung account from our phone. Ok, let's start! This is Samsung S10 Plus, but as I told you, this will work on every Samsung phone with Android 10 and latest security patch. Like S20, S20 Plus, S9 line, S10 line, Note line and so on. For that purpose, first of all, and the most important, we will need a phone. We will do a factory reset of our phone and we will remove all data from the phone, so be prepared for that. And guys. If you are not already subscribed to my channel, please help me with subscribe and like my videos. Thank you. Ok, first let's see what's happened here. We have pin code enabled, we don't know it. Now we need to enter the recovery mode and factory reset our phone. For that purpose, turn on the screen and hold volume down plus power button. First. Turn on the screen and tap volume down and power and continue holding until the phone is turned off and you feel the vibration. When you feel it, move your fingers to volume up and Bixby button. If you don't have Bixby button, just volume up and power button. You enter the recovery. Ok, we are there now. We are at the recovery mode of our phone. From here, navigate with volume buttons and confirm with power button. Navigate and select wipe data factory reset and confirm with power button. Select factory data reset and confirm again. Ok, phone is formatting its data. Data wipe complete. And now select the first option reboot system now and wait the phone to reboot. Ok guys, phone is ready, it's factory reset and we can continue. Select your language, English and let's go. Tap on the arrow and user license agreement, tap next. An authorized attempt has been made to reset your device. You know this message, this means your phone was locked. Ok, let's connect to our Wi-Fi network. And the phone is connected, tap next. Phone is asking for PIN, we don't know this PIN. Tap here, just to check and verify your account. Phone is asking for account, we don't know this account. So from here comes the important steps. Go back here on the Wi-Fi screen, on the Wi-Fi network you are connected, tap here on the settings and tap advanced and for example tap on proxy and tap manual. Here tap somewhere so keyboard will appear. When keyboard appears tap on sticker and tap on go to Galaxy Store. Agree and you need to update the Galaxy Store, update it. And you need to repeat again all steps. Tap on settings, advanced, proxy, manual, tap somewhere, keyboard appear, tap here on the stickers, go to Galaxy Store. From here, tap on the search icon and search for browser. Samsung Internet Browser. Tap on it. Here it is. Tap on it. 
and install. Wait for the application to be installed. Ok, application is installed and tap open. So, set as default browser, not now. And here, you can tap on Google and search for Apex Launcher. It's appear, tap on it. And don't open this link from Google Play, just scroll down and you can see here apkmirror.com. Tap on it, scroll down, and here is the button download APK. Tap on it, allow the permissions, and tap download. Start downloading. One file download. Okay. Now here tap on this button downloads. Tap it and here is your application. Tap on it. Give Samsung browser permissions to install applications. Go back and tap install. Okay, Apex Launcher installed. Open it. Continue and we are at the home screen of Apex Launcher. Now tap here, tap settings and we are now at the settings menu of our phone. From here go to biometrics and security, scroll down and you see other security settings. Tap it, scroll down and pin windows. Tap it, tap on, use screen lock type to unpin. Enable it and enter a pin that you want. I will put four zeros. One, two, three, four. Tap continue and enter again the same pin. One, two, three, four. Okay. We are ready here. Now just hold the power button and select restart. Restart and restart again. is our start, you will see the lock screen of the phone and it asks for the pin code that we previously entered. It's 4-0, tap OK, starting Android, OK, let's go, tap next, we are already connected to Wi-Fi, tap next and Now, phone is asking for the pin code that we previously entered. Tap four zeros and next. And that's it guys, we are ready, almost. Just now, tap skip, skip and follow all the instructions and go to your home screen. Guys, we are at the home screen of our phone. From here, go to settings. I will just show you that we are using the latest security patch. About phone, software information, you can see One UI 2.1, Android version 10. Scroll down and here it is guys. Android security patch level from 1st of June 2020. Now go back, general management, reset, factory data reset, tap it, when you tap reset it will ask again for that pin that we previously entered, four zeros, 
Thanks for watching that video guys. If this video helps you, please subscribe to my channel and like my videos for more videos like this. Thank you. Delete all.